spokesperson of the BJP. Mr. Gaurav Bhatia, the charges against the BJP uh, are several, starting from intimidation, revenge, uh, trying to kill press, uh, press freedom in this country, to kill democracy. Um, and on the other hand, your one-line statement is just about a routine search. The timing of this routine search, why is it just within a month of the banned documentary by the BBC, is the question raised by your critics. How do you respond? Navika, it is not the Bharti Janta Party that has to respond to the frivolous charges of the opposition. Rather, it is the BBC that has to act like a responsible organization, law-abiding organization, and show the citizens of India that they believe in rule of law. They are not above the law of the country and the constitution. Number two, is it not correct that the IT department has served notices to the BBC. Now it is for the BBC and they have made a statement that they are cooperating with the inquiry being held by the IT department. The question is this, that if the inquiry itself is suffering from the vice of malefides, why don't they move the court and get it quashed? Second, when the survey is being conducted and it's an ongoing process right now, What's this staring rush of the opposition parties to give a clean chit to the BBC and condemn the IT department action? That itself speaks volumes and it shows that with the poor track record that BBC has against India, the Congress party and the opposition parties have decided to stand with the BBC rather than have faith in the IT department. Last but not the least, when they make charges of uh, taking away the rights of the citizens, of freedom of speech and expression, I am reminded how Indira Gandhi banned BBC for two years. It was Indira Gandhi who invoked emergency. And if there was a black day after independence in India, it was the imposition of emergency by Indira Gandhi. So the Congress party should just wait for the outcome of this survey and then comment, I think that would augur well. And last but not the least, one more thing I would say. They're questioning the timing. Navika, you tell me, we have shown that under Narendra Modi ji, all the investigating agencies and the IT department is truly independent and autonomous. So the IT department should ask the government, because documentary I have, I am I think, you know, nothing could be more frivolous as an argument given by the Congress. I think the IT department should be allowed to do their job. Well, Sutesin Poonawala, my question to 